I think I'm past the point of just exhaustion. And I know like moving is supposed to be fun and exhilarating and like f makes you full of adrenaline. And don't get me wrong, I'm very happy that we've moved. But that doesn't mean that I'm not extremely tired. And I think I am missing my dogs tenfold. I just watched a video of a horse on Facebook and I cried. I had uh, my eyes welled up because all I could think about was the fact that my dogs are not with me and that I can't just cuddle them and hug them and love them and show them my love. It's October the 2nd and I literally have to wait until November the 27th until I get them. Until they are even in the same country as me. It's, it's saddening because them being away for so long is pretty much purely my fault that I didn't pre-plan it better. I didn't, um, I just didn't think about it in more depth. I was so worried about applying for three other people's visas rather than the dog's visa. But in my mind, I thought that the dog's visa was only a three month quarantine period, but it's a six month quarantine period. Who the fuck, like what country makes a quarantine period for six months? <laughs> I've had my period for two weeks. Maybe that's why I'm so emotional. Who knows? I'm just tired. We're moving to a house on Thursday. We've been at Airbnbs, living out of suitcases for six weeks now. We move into our actual house in five days. Yes, I'm excited. I am extremely excited. I cannot wait to build a life in this new house also it's beautiful and i love it so much i love it so much it is absolutely stunning i cannot wait to buy a whole new house full of plants i cannot wait to decorate it i cannot wait to set up my closet I, i'm just no today it's raining although don't let this bright light deceive you it's just because this room is the whitest thing apart from fucking paper this room everything is white everything is white so that's why it's so bright right now but outside it is pissing down rain I went to an amazing steakhouse last night that was that was amazing I love steakhouses. I think they are the best things in sliced bread. Very, very delicious, but I had way too much red wine and my head is killing me. Probably another reason why I'm so emotional because my head hurts. That was a quick little rundown. It wasn't really quick, but that was a rundown as to what I'm doing with my life right now. I did not realize that brand new appliances are so expensive. We literally have to get everything. A fridge, a washing machine, couch, table, three beds, like just everything. TV, right down to placemats, right down to a doorstop, all the way up to like a freaking TV. Everything. We need to get everything. Goodbye money, pretty much. That's okay, because we're building a life that we love and money comes and goes. Time, experiences, memories do not. You build them once, and that's it. Money can come and go. Money you can spend, the next year you can make it all back. Money comes and goes, and I solely, wholeheartedly believe that. And I'm sorry if this is a little bit shaky, you're kind of sitting on my knee, but Money comes and goes. And I used to be very 
like I'm not stupid with my money I do spend my money on things that I enjoy and I love and that I know is gonna bring me happiness yes I'm not the best at money but I would rather enjoy my life than have so much money just sitting there doing nothing with it so pick and choose what you wish I like to spend my money within consideration obviously I'm not stupid with my money but I am smart with what I choose to spend it on I choose to spend it on will this make me happy is this just a vibe a like a small unthoughtful thought through process that I want is this just a hype that's going around the world right now or is this actually going to bring me joy peace happiness whatever right like my new leggings yeah I could have got much cheaper leggings but I love my leggings all of my leggings are with this one company and I'm not gonna cheap out and buy cheap shit leggings and you can you end up seeing my underwear through no I'm gonna buy leggings that I love leggings that look good leggings that feel good and leggings that ultimately make me feel more self-confident because I love what I'm wearing Anyway, I just went off on a tangent then. And I have a tea leaf in my teeth. But have a good day. This is just a quick update because I love yous. And I thought you would like an update on my life. And I'm going to enjoy my tea. My laptop is charging. I'm going to edit this video and I'm going to put it out because I want the days to actually line up with what I'm saying. So bye guys.